You realize we're halfway through the show? Well, I guess that means I'm halfway through my nap. No! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. well, well, right now you're about to see a man break a world's record. It's his own record, and it's for appearing on the Oscar show more than anybody else. An incredible 24 times. Of course, when you think about it, he's probably appeared everywhere more than anybody else. <laughs> he's been traveling the world and making it laugh for 60 years. And even if we took the whole three hours of this show, it wouldn't be enough to thank him for all the memories. Here he is in his record-breaking 25th appearance to present the Gene Herschel Humanitarian Award. But I want to tell you, Bob Hope. Thank you, Alan. Thank you. He'd been saying nice things to me ever since I did that Christmas show on the set of M.A.S.H. <laughs> but I'm happy to be here. He said it's my 25th time. I think they ought to give me an Oscar just for attendance, don't you? <laughs> but I'm happy to be here at this annual Hollywood lottery, <laughs> known at my house as Passover. And I love seeing Don Amici made it. I think that's a beautiful thing. Isn't that great? And he did it with break dancing. And all these years, I've tried to do it with great acting. <laughs> now, first it was George Burns, now Don Amici. I, I hope it's a trend. <laughs> but I'm here to tell you some of the credits of Charles Buddy Rogers. As an actor, Buddy starred in over 40 films, both silent and sound, including the first Oscar-winning picture, Wings. But Buddy Rogers' biggest role was as a humanitarian, and that commands our attention and our respect tonight. Buddy has given his time and his effort generously to so many organizations, including the Motion Picture and Television Fund, the Jewish Home for the Aged, and the Hollywood Stuntman's Lupus Foundation, the National Conference of Christians and Jews, of which he's a member of the National Board of Directors, the Boy Scouts of America, the Navy League, the USC School of Cinema, the Los Angeles Philharmonic, and the USO. Buddy's recent honors include the 1985 Special Angel Award from Child Help USA, the Screen Smart Set Award for his work on behalf of the Motion Picture Country Home, and he will be honored this year as St. Jude's Hospital's Man of the Year. Every Christmas, Buddy has personally visited the Midnight Mission on Skid Row and entertained at the Veterans Assistant League Christmas parties. If I list any more, you'll be expecting him to come out here wearing a halo. But to these organizations and the people they serve, he's an angel. To myself, he's one of the nicest people I've ever met. Personally, I think Gene Hirschholt would have been most honored to call Buddy Rogers his son in real life. It's a pleasure now to introduce to you the man with the very appropriate nickname, Charles Buddy Rogers, right here. makes me feel very happy to give you this Gene Herschel Humanitarian Award right here. I'm thrilled, Bob. Thank it's you, yours. thank you, thank you, thank right. you. Right. And I also want to thank the Academy from the bottom of my heart. You know, they say that old actors never die. They just lose their parts. <laughs> I haven't lost all of my parts because this is the best part I've ever had in all the years I've been living in Hollywood. This is my best part. And if Gene's looking down on us tonight, I hope he's pleased, because I'm thrilled. I'm going to take this Oscar and take it home and proudly put it beside Mary's two Oscars. And Bob, yes, sir. Bob, I'm here. I'm I here. want to say thanks for my memories. <laughs> Thank you, Bob. Thanks for making time. I'm so thrilled. I'm here with Bob and be here with You know, 
The show doesn't have to be funny to be good. Well, how's this show? Well, it's, um, good. <laughs> <laughs>